Hi! In this video, I'm going to migrate a WordPress site from the local host to a production server. I'm going to show you how to do this using popular tools PHP MyAdmin, Total Commander, and Notepad. Okay, let's go. Here is the local site that we are going to migrate. The first step is to export the WordPress database. Here is the PHP MyAdmin panel where you can see that my database is called WordPress. Export this database using the quick export method. OK, I have a WordPress database export. Now I am going to modify the exported file. Start your favorite text editor with a find replace function. I use Notepad++ for this task. Open the exported file and use the Find Replace dialog and replace the local WordPress URL with the production one. In my case, it's replacing the local URL HTTP localhost slash WordPress with HTTP sample.itcuties.com. If you use plugins or themes that rely on the WordPress installation path, make sure to find and replace those values as well. OK, my database dump is ready. Now I need to import it into my target database. Log into the target database. Navigate to the Import section. Enter the path to your exported database file and click Go. The database has been successfully imported. Now I'm going to modify the local configuration file to set the target database parameters so that WordPress can connect to the new database. Open the wp-config.php file and set db name, db user, db password, db host as appropriate for the new database. Now my WordPress files need to be uploaded to the server. I've configured an empty test subdomain for this video, sample.itcuties.com. Copy the local WordPress files to the server. It might take some time depending on the content. After that's finished, take a look at the new site sample.itcuties.com The local content has been migrated and is available on the production server. So that's how it works. I hope this video was useful for some of you guys out there. Bye!